Okay, so I've been asked about the uh, claim that Jesus was assumed or raised into heaven uh, from the empty from the tomb, and uh, you know I, I would just suggest reading this book, Daniel Smith's Post Mortem Vindication of Jesus in the Sayings Q, in the Sayings Gospel Q, where he talks about the Q Gospel and how there was an early Christian concept according to which Jesus was assumed into heaven from his tomb. So according to you know this scholar, he says that the early, the earliest Christians um, believe didn't believe in the resurrection, but they believed in Jesus' assumption into heaven from his tomb. According to Smith, this view is supported by the pre-Markian uh, passion narrative, a source which Mark used to uh, write his own gospel. That source lacked what uh, Mark has now supplied as Mark chapter 16 verse 7 to show that the angels informed the women that Jesus would appear to his disciples in Jerusalem. So according to the Q Gospel, um, Daniel Smith, and according to this book, of Re Revisiting the Empty Tomb, the Early History of Easter, Daniel A. Smith explains that uh, there was basically a document called Q, which predates any of the writings of the New Testament, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, the, the letters of Paul, etc., etc. Uh, the Q Gospel talked about Jesus' assumption into heaven and not a resurrection. Uh, you know, so that's what, so basically what he argues, what Daniel A. Smith shows, is that there were two beliefs. One belief that Jesus was assumed into heaven, and one belief that Jesus was resurrected and then ascended to heaven. Uh, and Paul was the one uh, preaching Jesus' resurrection in the Q community. Uh, was preaching Jesus' assumption into heaven. So it's possible that, it's very possible that the disciples or the disciples of the disciples were preaching Jesus' assumption and Paul is the one who made up the resurrection story as found in uh, uh, 1 Corinthians chapter, uh, chapter 15, Galatians 1, where Paul propagates his gospel, which is the resurrection. And the Q gospel was talking about Jesus'